Hello, kids of all ages. Welcome to Once and Scale. Um, well, here's a, a quick uh, customization that I did on my speeder bike, Hasbro 2003, with a, um, a Scout. Now, the helmet on that figure is actually from the uh, Scout. That's on, the, I mean, from the Hasbro figure. And what I did was pull it off and cut it out and then sliced the, the sides. And then I opened it up and I fitted it on t onto the figure. Actually, I saw that I believe some pictures on SSF, so that was really cool. So that also inspired me to start doing something with this uh, speeder bike. Um, and also on Mark OSR, which is the one six scale community. Uh, if you're not familiar with that, it's on Facebook. And I saw some pictures of a scout biker. So anyway, back to the uh, bike. Uh, so I had this uh, for a while and I'm like, what am I going to do with it? I'm probably going to get the uh, Sideshow one, so it's been a die cast, right? So uh, I guess it's uh, better made, but I look at both of them and I'm like, oh, compared pictures. And I'm like, you know, they look the same, exactly the same. There's a little bit of a difference in the, um, on the front of the, uh, the Sideshow one, but anyway, whatever. So anyway, what I did was I added some stuff. I added some lighting. I added a propeller. I'm going to add some more lights. I need a little board to put everything on there. I added some resistors and you, a whole bunch of shit. And I got it from a, um, a VCR as well. Uh, I took a like a little uh, drone and uh, took some stuff off of that, which was the propeller. Uh, I'll show you what I did. So I put this... Um, this was from an uh, actual f uh, uh, female like uh, Viking, and uh, I took that and I screwed it in. I'll show you. It's all apart. The bike comes in three pieces. I also added some ammo patches, uh, pouches, excuse me, on the side here, and some little transistors, some wiring fed. I piloted through. I'll show you some uh, closer details in a second. Um, I did it on both sides, and here's the propeller, and then there's a light that's going to be working there and uh, some stuff back here it's all glued on no problems anything coming off and then I'm also going to have this weathered I'm going to have um, Brian too many figures do it for me I know he's going to hook it up once I set up the harness in, in the interior with the lighting it's going to look unbelievable uh, this is going to be a badass piece and uh, I can't wait to have it uh, you know a little futuristic apocalyptic uh, kind of uh, uh, bounty hunter, you know, comes off a spaceship and uh, descends down into a planet and starts fucking taking down people. That's what I'm, that's my concept. That's my idea why uh, I did this figure. So let me show you a little bit of all the material that I used and you'll get an idea and I'll open this up for you, show you the head of that figure. Uh, you're going to be blown away when you see that. All right, so let's... Uh so guys, here's the stuff that I use. Uh, so this is part of the uh, VCR circuitry. And you just pull things out what you think you would want. And there's nothing wrong with uh, um, making something. You know, you're creating something. There's no right or wrong. You're not actually replicating anything. So it's, it's your idea that you want to come up with, uh, you know, and create something that you want. And how you want to you know, make it, and and that's the way it's going to be, the way you want it. Um, so, because I can't uh, recreate, I create, <laughs> and that's basically it. So, this is part of the VCR. Uh, it was, a, you know, it's a nice, you know, takes a little bit of time taking it apart, and, you know, getting some boards out. Uh, the older, the better. New shit, don't have too much. Everything's much smaller. Uh, much more compact back in the days uh, they, when they put shit together boy they really did a lot of major work this is why this shit must have been crazy expensive back then damn it um, yeah so anyway uh, and also this is part of the uh, that remote control like kind of drone thing that flew, in, that flew around took that out and uh came up with a little idea which I added a propeller one of the propellers a tiny one in the back of the uh, the engine and I'll show you that right now 
that thing is uh, sick. So, oh, well, this is part of that little drone thing. Don't need that anymore. But I did take this out of the VCR, which I think this is really cool. Um, looks like the the uh, reactor for uh, Tony Stark, right? So I don't know. I'm gonna try to maybe put little lights in here or something like that. I saw like a strip that you can actually put on, and I saw how they. Uh, there's a video, not a couple of videos on uh, on YouTube that you can check out. Anyway, um. So here's the battery compartment, which is just too big, so I'm not I'm not gonna be able to fit that into there. So I'm gonna have to um, uh, buy a whole bunch of other stuff and um, put it in. It's gonna look sick, but I'll show you. This is uh, pretty cool, uh, really cool, <laughs> not pretty cool, really really cool. So this is the rear, and that's what's gonna be right in the back of the speeder bike. And I'm gonna show you. There you go. Turn it on. So awesome. Love this. Yeah, I love things that roll. It's crazy. Can you imagine that in the back? <laughs> you know, when you have a switch and you turn it on, it's going to look so fucking cool. It's going to sound so cool, too. You know? So it's like uh, this guy's a bounty hunter for me, and. Uh, He's traveling on a spaceship, and then he takes his, uh, you know, his speeder bike and goes down to the planet, executes whoever he needs to execute, and that's it. Basically, that, that you know, that's what it's about. You know, it's about you creating, you know, your ideas and and just having fun with the hobby. You know, this is what I love. This is what I really love to do. So anyway, uh, just added some stuff here, and uh, it's all tied in nicely. And I did take that uh, that blanket that he had out of the straps. I took that out. I didn't want that. So that's gone. I'll show you the interior. Oh, by the way, the light here, um, I was going to show it to you, but I can't because, unfortunately, uh, one of the um, uh, came loose here, so I have to resolder that. And I was going to use that battery power to show you how it illuminates, which is amazing the multiple of lights and flashing so it's uh, pretty cool um, also I added the horns with two screws I piloted really carefully and that's how that stays attached it's not glued so it'll never come off and maybe uh, you know Brian could uh, paint that up that shit looks fucking cool the front of that <laughs> reminds me of like one of those uh, cars from uh, Texas and shit but uh yeah, it's, so this is pretty awesome. And then over here, I'm gonna open this up really nice with a Dremel, and uh, that's where I'm gonna add, add my switch on and off the toggle, so that way I can turn on the fan and uh, the light in the back. And then I'm gonna have one, two, and three lights already pilot the holes there, so that's gonna look fantastic with the lights on. It's, you know, something different. And so the interior of this vehicle on oh, the base it's not, it's not this vehicle the speeder bike um, I added wiring cabling and I piloted through and then you know this has to be glued again and just give it a different element you know something different and also the ammo patches a uh, pouch excuse me on the sides of both and that's basically it and let me just show you the uh, head sculpt on this guy, which he looks terrific. Whoa. You know who this guy is? That's uh, the Prince. I got this a few years back. Which looks awesome. Just got to fix his hair. That static electricity. But that head sculpt is sick. I wish I knew who sold this to me. Anyway, yeah, and and this guy was uh, custom made. Actually, everything on him is uh, custom made. Even the um, this holster, this leather guy made that for me. I paid money to put this uh, gun in there because I wanted to put keep the uh, the scope on it. So it's made out of leather, the belt and everything. It's a guy that does uh, a lot of, um, what does he do? He does a lot of saddles. I don't know where he's from, but 
is pretty awesome. The wall dropping everything around. But I love this figure. It's all hot toy body. Oh, cigarette light. But anyway, it's a long night. <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> you know how I say, boys and girls, I know you don't like me, but you like my style.